So, dude, how how was your lunch? The the Bog Fenris Inks meetup. Inkscon 2015. Yeah, Fenris. Uh, he didn't make any random <laughs> kind of noises, which was good. He uh, didn't and do how, anything. How do you know weird. it was really him? It looked like him. You yeah. look like I have face. I have a, a few doppelgangers in the closet. Master. Sometimes I send them out. The double gears. And it took me like most of the lunch to realize that Inks had shaved. <laughs> really? As soon as I saw him, I was like, "What the hell?" <laughs> I, th I, didn't, I didn't notice it at all. And then all of a sudden, <laughs> one of you guys said mentioned it. I was like, "Oh yeah." Uh, oh no! Is this the script thing? Yep. Yeah. Entry defense. That's so much fun. Actually, the word I use, but it's the word you use. Boring. Pretty scritty. <laughs> <laughs> so how did everyone's Christmas go? I got my mom a giant blanket with a picture of her chihuahua on it. Where did you possibly do that? <laughs> Shutterfly. You should have put my head on the blanket. That's what, I'm, <laughs> that's what I'm giving you next year for Christmas. Come on, my head on a blanket is that's pretty pretty OP. Yeah. Especially with cool. one of my like cheesy dad grins. No, your rage face. Bog otter yeah. rage. The skewered Norn head emote. On a blanket. All the emotes. That'd actually be a really cool idea. <laughs> that would actually be really cool. Rainami in chat says no need to tra traumatize the woman. Did that person mean your head or the severed Norn head? The target of the traumatization was clear. It's Peachy's mom. But whether or not it's in the form of a severed Norn head or my face is unclear. <laughs> <laughs> Can we get some clarification, please? I just clarified. Keep up, man. So, anybody have any weird or embarrassing holiday stories? No. Nothing weird? No one has a crazy uncle? Mm -hmm. My my son fell asleep on his new Hot Wheels track and woke up with a big, huge line going across his face. Oh. <laughs> we got him the big, like, ultimate garage. It's like eight feet wide by three feet tall. He's not willingly left it to even eat or sleep for the last four days. Yeah. I have some some stories from chat. Mooney's mom dropped the eggnog. Tragic. Oh, and, no. And PK fell asleep in the middle of dinner with a spoon in his or her mouth. <laughs> that That's even pretty wow. top advantage. You How old are you? <laughs> you're picturing a, picturing <laughs> a high chair, if, right? <laughs> right, because if you're like three, then... Then that's you're adorable. Then you're... If you're like 53, not so adorable. <laughs> you're just drunk. Yeah. Does anyone know what not your father's root beer is? Yeah. Yep. So apparently there's like a ginger ale version of that. Isn't that weird? And I had it on Christmas Eve. But you're not 21, no, Fenris, and you're admitting this I'm on the here. internet. Yeah. <gasps> no. And we know where you live. Come get me. I got to drink in front of Fenris at our lunch be like... You want some? <laughs> Too bad! Oh, that'd be terrible. Sweet, you definitely didn't say that to treasure. me. I definitely didn't. You're right. He did. He wish he did. I did I did have a nice margarita, though. Yeah, it was pretty big. You'd have to be to have lunch with Fenris. I know, so I felt like I needed. Plus, you know, Inks was next to me without his beard, and it was, you know, it was, it was, a, lot, it was a lot to handle. <laughs> Are you okay, Rindar? Yeah. You sick? No. Are you mad at me? No. <laughs> Why? He's mad at me. I don't know. You sound you, you sound like you're pissed. Mad at the world. Oh. Yeah, no. you're, you're awfully quiet. I'm mad at age because age hates freedom. I knew it. What? <laughs> oh, you hate freedom? That means you hate America? So some of you might know because I shared it on Twitter, but I I made my toe really purple yesterday. Oh yeah, I saw that. Oh yeah, and it, and it looks worse. See. It looks worse than the post because it's just getting worse and worse, black and blue. Is it actually no. broken or? I've broken my big toe twice before, and so I kind of know how it feels. But no, I haven't gotten this one specifically checked because I'm a dumbass. Is it throbbing or is it just swelling up and hurting? It it there's a little throbbing, but it's it's mostly just swollen and stiff and touching it is really bad i come in just on God it's a little <laughs> throbbing all right so what happened was i was i was walking up the stairs with a bowl of cereal right 
and I just misjudged, and instead of my entire foot, like, hitting the stair solidly, just the big toe hit, and I put all my weight on it, so it bent up. And I collapsed <laughs> on the stairs, dropped the cereal and milk everywhere. Snapples runs over to me, because I was screaming, of course, and starts lapping up all the cereal and then milk. eats. Yeah, I was going to say. <laughs> there was, there was no okay, me. okay. Well, at least the cereal didn't go to waste. I scared the crap out of my kids. My kids were like running around. Are you okay? And I, like I couldn't, I couldn't even talk to them. It was just like I was seeing stars. Just like, I need a minute. I need a minute. I'm just gonna scream for a minute. And what were you eating at dinner? We had butter chicken lasagna, and Wait, it was what? delicious. What the hell is that? What the hell is that? Yeah. It's like butter chicken, in lasagna form. I don't even know I, what buttered chicken is. I don't is. even know what buttered chicken is. What? What is buttered chicken? It sounds really, really bad for you. <laughs> it does. It's a chicken it's, uh, with butter Indian, on it. It's, it's Indian, in, an Indian dish. So butter chicken is an Indian dish. Not butter, B-U-T-T-E-R? Yep, yep. It's called butter chicken, and it's an Indian dish, and it's delicious on its own, and I can't get in the puzzle. Because of the butter chicken? No. Unrelated to the butter chicken lasagna. Well, actually, it was related because she was finishing eating it and thus is late for missions. But it's, <laughs> that's a good point right there. So when you say, God, no, when I asked you about cooking, does that mean you don't cook often? Uh, no, I, I, well, I'm lazy, so I don't. But I like cooking. Cooking takes away from game time. So I'm totally with you on that. Except I actually don't like cooking it on top of that. Oh. And you live alone? That sucks. Thanks for bringing that up, Fed. <laughs> rub, rub the dirt. Rub Unless you, like, employ your kids to start cooking for you, which may or may not be a good idea, because you can be, like, one of those kids on, on those chef shows now that they have. You, ever, you no. see that? There's, like, no. there's like six-year-olds who are, like, chefs. I tried to have my older son at 11 take his own frozen pizza out of the oven today, and that was an issue. So I don't think cooking them cooking for me is going to be happen anytime soon. I wasn't even the last person to do the emote. <laughs> Might have been me. Paris. Yeah, because I actually uh, performed the emote as opposed to whispering it. <laughs> <laughs> so what did everybody get for Christmas? I actually got a back scratcher. They go to this holiday gift shop in school where they can bring money and buy things for like the parents and stuff. And every year I get like like the dad the dad gifts are always like tools so i get like screwdrivers and all kinds of stuff like yeah. that which i will never use so i told my son this year i'm like you can buy me anything you want just don't like don't get me tools I'm like i'm not a tool guy so he came home with a back scratcher i was like hey nice <laughs> and it's funny because my older son moved up to the middle school and they don't do that in middle school so my older son had nothing no presents for anyone it was just kind of sad Aww. Now we're going to go to our series of rushes. We have three of them. That's why I want his hair. <laughs> oh, boy. <You> dick. <laughs> <laughs> well, welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the first of three guild rushes today. We are going to turn into various little creatures and race at the end of the rush. And the person that comes in first place is going to name a creature or animal of Tyria that the person that comes in last place has to make a noise like on voice chat for the internet to make fun of. We're going to type in guild chat when we come in first, second, third place, etc. So there's no cheating. And winners of previous weeks will be uh, will have a penalty to their start time. And currently we have Gift, Blaze, and Rio with 10 second penalties. Remember, we wiped all of the penalties from the last season. This is the new Heart of Thorn season. Good luck, everybody. We're all counting on you. Uh, uh, finally. Did you, you get won? first what? last week? That's your first win ever? Yes. Oh Grab. My Yay! God. So you've had like a year and a half to think of like the perfect noise. I have the animal, no but pressure. it's not a hard thorns animal. It has to be a sea moth that's drunk on eggnog. <laughs> those are those beaver things. Yeah. Beat their beaver hippos. I'm gonna be making the noise because I had to start again. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. You have a great sea moth impression. Sure do. No. Yes. Uh, it's gonna be like a showdown between Pear and Strolly. Pear and the Peach. 
pear versus the peach. Fruit finish. <laughs> <laughs> the fruit apocalypse has begun. Oh no. Uh, four people? Yeah, I didn't finish. So, wow. So Peachy, Pear, Visceral, and who else? Fenris. No, I finished. Uh, oh, he didn't put a in. number in. <laughs> you put no number oh in, God. counts yeah. as no finish. Oh. Yes! No! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's the best with the cookies in his mouth. No! <laughs> so, you, so, wow, age is first time winning and he gets four people to make his noise. Feels good. Oh, man. I bailed you out before, Fenris. I saw this the whole way and didn't bail you out this time, because I've done it before. Nice. All right, so according to the rules, if you don't type what place you come in into chat, you also have to make the noise. So we now have Aurora Peachy, One Big Pair, Fenris, and Visceral, who all have to make the noise of a Siamoth, which is a gross, like, bi like four-legged hippo beaver creature. Who is drunk on eggnog. And that's song. because age, uh, for the first time, has won. So whenever you guys are ready. Eggnog. <laughs> there, I'm done. It's someone else's turn. Burp. There's number two. That's two. Oh. 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 <laughs> oh, that was good. I like that one. That was mine. <laughs> There's a little bit of mouth uh, mouth vomit going on there. And? <laughs> <laughs> new, new donation sound. Uh. If you want to. <laughs> <laughs> Do animals make human sounding throat noises? Yes. Oh man, that was funny. So for, I never actually answered the Christmas question. Uh, for Christmas, I once again got clothes from my mother-in-law that are 20 years too old and two sizes too big. Oh no. Every year. How many years? Uh, 15, 14. Nice. That's more than half my age. <laughs> yeah, she really seems to think I'm two sizes larger than I am. Wow. It's a fat joke. I want to hear someone make a Mordrum sniper hunting bog. What the hell? Wow. So now you can actually speak English. A Mordrum sniper hunting bog? Yeah. Me? That's actually good. Oh my god. Because you can speak senses. So, Brainiac, how did you get all the alcohol to make that shoulder piece? You bought it? No, I did the jumping puzzle. Really? Like 95,000 times? Yeah. Damn. Because, like, I've been working on that, and I have... I have little alcohol farmers in my house. My kids do the jumping puzzle, they send me all the alcohol. And I'm, st I'm still, like, at 3,000 drinks. Ridge, I think we need to talk. I think you have a problem. The They're going to go to school and talk about this, and you're going to get a call. <laughs> yeah. I send my dad all the buttered spirits. Or he he drank 3,000 drinks over the holidays. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Dr. Brainiac, you knew one out of three you would have to do this, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. All right, so because, <laughs> because Rindar has won the race, he has decided Everything that Dr. Did. Brainiac is going to make a noise like a Mordrum sniper who is hunting Bog Otter. Whenever you're ready, sir. How were your endeavors progressing? dangerous times okay that's too much tension i gotta cut it off there whoa everybody cleans the clean the power <laughs> too much stress there's too much stress going on there by the way the the chat room is saying that the uh a mordrum sniper hunting by Goddard would probably be silent so that was an accurate <laughs> oh, yep. oh nice is he taking the silence as a uh, 
Yes, I am. Really? You're going to cop out? Should have at least said pew at the end. <laughs> yeah, you should have just been like, like cocking your gun. Wow, you totally escaped that. How do you feel? He's probably felt a lot of pressure. I don't know. <laughs> I want you to make a, the noise of a severed Norn head that has been magically severed so that the head is still alive, thinking that the magician was going to have a font of information to store, but instead it is a very uh <laughs> okay, well, let me stop I mean, the fact there. that you that have to break it what? complicated <laughs> break it down yeah i lost the train of thought halfway through that <laughs> but it was like it's a like very ramble. like keep rambling but it's like a very muscly norn so it's very stupid norn so that's what i want is a severed norn head that instead of being very smart it's a very dumb severed norn head but why would it be smart? Because they're already dumb. A dumb a Severed Norn head. Is that, this yes. is what we summarize it as? Okay. Yeah. What was the part about the magician and the backstory? <laughs> like, backstory? Like, yeah, I want to know more about that. that. Severed Norn head. He, he went to a magic show the day before, and he had oatmeal for breakfast, and that's the Severed Norn head. Matsta has chosen that the noise you have to make is a Severed Norn head that has had a long day. It is a dumb severed Norn head that Visrule has now has to make a noise like whenever you're ready, sir. Man, it's been a long day. I just can't keep myself together. <laughs> <laughs> Dun -dun.